Hello everybody, my name is Parak, and in today's video, as you can see, we're back in World, and today I wanted to actually give a proper bow build a try, because back when I played it ages ago, I only used Dragon Piercer spam, and I wanted to try the real bow build, as with the Lance build that I made a video on just earlier, earlier being like 12 hours ago, I went straight to the meta edit, because it seemed to work okay for the Lance, so we may as well do the same here because I have no idea how to build a build in this game, but it seems pretty similar to what I know from Rise, where it's get your attack skills, which in this game is normal shots, spread shots, constitution, and stamina surge, as well as bow charge plus, of course. So I think I could probably make my own bow builds now, but for the time being, we're going to use this one here with the Safi Bolt Bow. There's also no Shaver Jewel on here. I could have put Shaver in, but I feel like most of the time I should be able to turn the monster a few times to get that guaranteed uh, weaken on the first weaken, of course. So I'm going to somewhat rely on that. Grab these rocks, of course, get a decent start so we can try and get that initial weaken, which we should be able to do. I think it's two or three wall slaps or two or three turn slaps and then a weaken should be enough for a light weapon. I don't know exactly which one, so you just can let me know there for those watching, of course, as well as people in the comments will help them out greatly knowing that but uh yeah let's let's get it started i also noticed stamina is a bigger issue than i realized with bow here with this bow you kind of got to go okay i'm gonna land a few shots here i'm gonna charge first and then shoot because otherwise it doesn't have extra arrows on the first level so it works out better also i dislike that attack greatly so hopefully he doesn't spam that too often can also use uh, Thousand Dragons on here, which I didn't know existed when I played Bow before, which would have made the Dragon Piercer spam a lot stronger, but that's okay. Okay, nice. I figured I could probably get two shots in there, which tended to work just fine there. Also hard to remember to swap coding, but hopefully I do remember because it is... I'd imagine it's a pretty considerable amount of damage to actually swap to power coding off raw or off uh, zero coding in general, but we'll see here. Okay, nice. So that, just so we get the extra shots, nice and easy. It saves quite a bit of stamina there too, I feel like. Nope, okay. When you uh, dodge first, that is. Okay, we've got 20 shots left. I also don't know whether this is better than the uh, full raw build, because I do have all the Fatalis weapons. I could chuck that on. I shouldn't have gone backwards. That's fine, he doesn't jump back. This isn't Rise. There, okay. Um, yeah, I don't know if this is better than Fatalis on this matchup. I feel like it might be better, possibly. Because he's only got like a 25 hit zone for uh, element and 45 raw. So I feel like this is probably definitely better. Right, nice, let's go grab piercing pods. Do, 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 do. Chuck that on too, why not? I also should change the coding soon, I feel like, because I probably forget. Although that's like a fifth of my ammo sitting right there, so we do have a decent uh, bit of ammo to use. Uh, a thousand dragons. Kaboom! Nice and easy. Does some decent damage for sure. Okay. Nope. Get some more shots. Nice and easy. It does so much damage, actually. Like, you think about it, compared to the other weapons I've played, this is doing some filthy damage per shot if I actually hit the face. And I think on my next Clagger, I should go for a Weaken, I think. Okay. Because we definitely want to try and keep it weakened if we can. We'll deal a lot more damage to him with that extra hit zone value. Okay. Nice. -y. I hate this attack so much, so I'm just going to roll under him. Luckily, I was close enough. Such a painful attack to deal with that one. Okay, nice. Should have dodged, but that's fine. We weaken this one. There we go. Bop, 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 bop. Ah, missed the face. It's all right. Nope. Okay, there we go. He turned around, sadly, but that's fine. Try hit the face. Nope. Okay. Back it up and get a shot in. Okay. Nope. Some more shots in again. Nope. There. There. And stop, because we have no stamina. Okay. There we go. Oh, no, 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 no. 
Ah, I hate that attack so much. Such a garbage attack. There. Okay. Yeah, we lost the uh, the weaken there. I feel like. Definitely not ideal. There. Okay. Oh, I'm not using close coding as well. As I said, it's hard to remember. Okay. That's some better damage. Nice clagger. Or not. I was hoping it was a clagger because uh, I don't think his face is weakened at the moment. Which we definitely want it to be. All nice. Good sleep. Get a thousand dragons again. I think there's... Yeah, there it is. Okay. Grab that. Change. There we go. Kaboom. Juicy damage. Oh, I can animation cancel it. I wasn't sure if it actually did it last time, but uh, definitely looks like you can. Nope. Also want to go for that wall bang. As I said, if we get a, a weaken, we'll deal much more damage from that increased hit zone. If he gives me a decent enough attack to actually get it. Maybe? No, I have to move there. Okay, that'll probably work. Slap him once. Unfortunate. So unfortunate. Okay. Okay. Nope. And nope. Oh, really? Okay. Yeah, we're dealing so much less damage, as you can tell. Nice stagger. Oh, that was Clagger. Hell yeah. We needed that. Because now I can weaken the face properly. Yep, there we go. Now it's all white. Okay. Nice, Sue. Now we deal some decent damage again. Happy to see that. Yep, I figured it was a dashing one. Okay. Nope. After my cat. It's fine. Get some hits. As I said, this is my first time properly playing bow. Because uh, I used to just dragon pierce the spam. Good to see my muscle memory of this weapon's carrying me as well. Even though my time looks really crap considering... Uh, Pretty sure I can do this faster with a baby version of Charge Blade, but that's okay. Okay. Nope. Chase him down. Okay. Good, he's doing that at pause. It's not at me. I don't have to try and dodge it. Love to see that. There we go. Yeah, it took much longer than I expected, to be honest. Maybe you do just run a raw set on Tigrex, or Brute Tigrex, that is. Because it's like a, a 25 element and 45 raw on the head. Well, everybody, that was finally trying out a proper bow build in Iceborne. It felt, honestly, as good as I thought it would. Just dashing around the monster, landing power shots, landing a couple shots, and then grappling the face to extend claggers. It felt really good, in all honesty. As always, thank you so much for watching, and I hope to see you on the next one.